Hey everyone, I'm Josh Carney. I'm a recording engineer, musician, and songwriter. Welcome to this studio series on vocal recording in Logic Pro. In popular music, the vocals are the most important element in the mix, and all the other instruments in the song will ultimately be worked around the vocals, but in the end, the vocal will still stand on top of all the other instruments in the mix. If you have a great instrumental, and even a great instrumental mix, but you have a bad vocal recording, or maybe the performance by the singer was bad, you still will end up with a bad mix. Having great sounding music will never save a bad vocal recording. So it's important to know the techniques and methodology involved to get great sounding vocal recordings. Don't cut any corners, don't take any shortcuts. In this course, I'll show you how to do it the right way. I'll talk about choosing the right microphone for your vocalist, I'll show you several different miking techniques and mic placement possibilities, and I'll demonstrate several different condenser and dynamic microphones, both on male and female vocals, in various different styles. And I'll also cover proper EQ and compression techniques to make your vocals pop out in the mix. I'll also cover various recording and editing techniques for vocals in Logic, including take folders, quick swipe comping, auto punch, and vocal tuning with flex pitch. If you're looking to thicken your vocal recordings by doubling or stacking up vocal takes, create and record harmonies, or get that big, thick backing vocal choir sound, you're in the right place. These are all topics I'll discuss in this course as well. So join me in this studio series on vocal recording and production in Logic Pro. I hope you enjoy the course.